What is up, everybody? Welcome back to Race 9 in our NASCAR Heat Career Series. Last race, uh, it was Bristol, and we actually won the freaking thing. And right now, we are sitting with $9,000. We are actually fifth in the Chase Danny's if we were start today. But one thing that I've not been paying attention to is the sponsors. And I want to think that we have a secondary sponsor now that we could do. Um, we're still using this guy. Oh, I guess not. So our next race is at uh, Richmond. But I want to say... One sec. Oh, we can only have one sponsor still. Okay. So for Richmond, I feel like we can get a top 20. So we're going to put it for a top 20. I feel like we can maybe get a top 15 because how well we've been doing on short tracks. But I'm, we're going to play it safe. And we're going to go with this. Uh, standings, we are 16th in standings, but again, if we were to start today because we have that win, we'd be starting 5th, which is awesome. I'm really freaking impressed by that. Uh, team, we just bought the stamping equipment, and our next is going to be the CAD software for 75 grand, so hopefully 2-3 races well enough to do that. So let's go ahead and jump into Richmond, guys. Go, 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 go. Alright, let's, uh, let's see how this is. I feel I feel pretty good about this race because how we have been doing. We finished eight at eighth at Martinsville, and then we won at Bristol. So I feel like we can maybe get a top ten or top fifteen. We'll just see how this lap goes real quick. Guys, I feel like this is gonna be really similar to New Hampshire. Just how, well, it's not as flat. I mean, it's yeah, it's not as flat as New Hampshire. Twenty fifth, okay, that's pretty good. Junior qualified twenty. Wow, they qualified pretty far back. But to me, it's really similar to New Hampshire because how flat it is getting into the corners. Um, so I feel like if we do well, we will do well there. So let's just see how we do, guys. Today we're coming to you from Richmond International Raceway for the Toyota Owners 400. This is Rick Allen, and Richmond is one of the driver's favorite stops on the circuit. Multiple grooves offer great passing opportunities and side-by-side -side racing. All right, it's let's play it safe here. There's a green flag. All right. Not the best start in the world. Car high. Car high. No wrecks in one and two. All clear. Oh, God. Crazy loose going into three. I probably got in the guess. Wait, look at these guys just blowing by me on the outside like that. Clear high. I really didn't want to go up top, but maybe it'll stick. Stay high. Still there. And I tell you, that feels way better up top. Wow. Look at my ability to pass a couple cars up there. That was not too bad. Thanks, Reagan. For cutting us off. Car high. Freaking Newman, really? He just got into the back of us. Still there. Clear high. Let's see if we can't dive off some of these guys and get a little quick. Car high. Clear low. Oh, it actually stuck. Car low. And Riggins gonna be stupid and. Car high. You don't belong up here, dude. What are you doing? Stay low. Still there. I'm kind of driving like an asshole right now. Carlo. Carlo. I like the outside because you can carry a little bit more speed and you can get to the gas way earlier. And the car doesn't get as loose up there. A little Stay bit more on. banking it feels Still like there. to catch your car. I can get into the gas way earlier up top. Carlo. That was a great lap. Carlo. If you don't have guys like David Reagan holding you up. Stay high. Still there. 
What the hell are you doing down there? Still there? Still there? He decided to make it three wide, I guess. I'm going to be clear. able to clear Carver. him. Yes. Nice. Okay, so we're up to 18th. A quarter of the way through the race. And we're going to set our sights now for the top 15. And if they run the lap traffic, I feel like that is going to play into our hands. We might be able to get a top 10 out of this thing. Of course, I'm being way, way, way optimistic right now. To go. We got these guys all over us, behind us. So I'm sure a couple of these guys are going to make their way by us. Car low. Car high. Well, they're just going to freaking split us. <laughs> Clear high. Car low. That's always going to happen. There's going to be like these chase drivers that are always oh, just so good. And they're just going to move it through the pack if they start in the bag. Clear high. So there's nothing I can really do about holding them off. driving this car as hard as I can too and they're still just that much better than me. And that was my bad. We need that lap traffic to start. It's only at these shorter tracks I can really start to feel like the tire wear. Well, even Texas too. I don't know if we had. I realize it now because during the race I didn't realize it, but I think we had damage on the right front. After we went across and I seen my car, like a 360 view, we did have damage on the right side. I don't know if we maybe slammed a wall or something or what happened, but I think between that and tire wear, that's why we couldn't move any farther up during that race. These guys are starting to get held up somehow by something. Okay, that's the halfway mark now. Halfway. So the pressure is kind of off a little bit. We are in the chase, but we do need to keep finishing, you know, decent top 20s to stay in the top 30. And with all these really big tracks coming up, I'm kind of nervous, like Michigan and Pocono and Indianapolis, because we don't have a really fast car horsepower-wise to hang with these guys. So we're just going to have to see... But of course, the draft in this game is crazy, so we might put a hang on. So it looks like these guys up here are starting to get in the pack. I'm hoping it's going to slow them down a little bit. Give me enough time to catch them. We're pulling away from the guys behind us, so no pressure there. Not sure why exactly, if it is lap traffic or what it is. Look at them, four wide. I don't know what the hell is going on up here. I don't see anybody that's a lap down.
nine to go. We just need to pass two of these guys. We need the top 20. I feel stupid if we didn't get a top 20 after I changed that sponsor. Drifted that sucker in there. And here comes Greg Bithful. It's all high. You're all clear. Side by side with Harvick. Of course, he's going to get an amazing run like they usually do. Still there. Clear high. All right, just one more. We got to hold off Biffle too. He's coming hard. Still oh, it's like they're stuck in there. Nice. Still there. That was a great lap. Still there. Car high. Sweet. Can we clear Kane? No, we can't. Still there. Clear high. Awesome, good deal. So we got up to 19th there, past three guys. We can afford for one more to pass us. But maybe we can catch somebody else here ahead of us. Catch any of these guys up front. But we can at least hold these guys off behind us. I'd be happy with that. Four laps to go. Here comes Damlin charging hard. They can't beat me into the corner, which is good. Oh my god. <laughs> Why does this freaking happen? They're not pitting, of course. Why does this always happen? Oh my god. This is the fourth race in a row we've had a green-white checkered. Maybe we can get a few spots here. Let's see. Oh, horrible start. right now but we got to Car high. Last lap. Car high. All clear. Uh, the 14th I don't think we're gonna catch anybody else and that's pretty much it yeah uh, so we're gonna finish 14th here that's worth a few points good deal I'm actually happy with that. Uh, speed rating, 30, 93. I mean, we were just 19th, so we gained five spots on that restart, so that actually helped us. I don't think we would have finished 14th if we didn't have that. Well, we definitely wouldn't have. I didn't think we had the speed to get a top 15. But we got lucky, okay. Who won the race? Joey Logano, I think that's his first one of the season. Almost 20 grand, our primary, five grand, secondary. Nice. Oh, that's awesome. That's Joey Logano's second win, wow. So we got some good points out of that. Still 16th place, awesome. That was a good finish. I'm happy with that. Finish event. I don't think anything's going to change. Next race is Talladega. Awesome. Got some good tracks coming up. So we have 41,000 now. Oh, secondary sponsors. Yes. Oh, my God. Oh, let's check this out. Oh, so we can have two now. What are you? Lead a lap? Qualify 20th? 
Oh, that's all. Oh, we get paid more money too now. Look at this. Wow. So right now we have top 20. I want to make this top 25. So then we can do that. At least so. That is really neat. Cool. That's just going to help us out get more money. We have 41 grand right now. Uh, we are... 34 grand away from getting this, so we probably won't get that at Talladega, but maybe Kansas the race after we can get that. But that's all for this episode, guys. I really appreciate it. I've been having a lot of fun doing this series. If you like this video, please go ahead and hit that like button and subscribe for more. And I will see you guys at Talladega.